I work at Verizon Wireless. We had had issues with management type of abusing their power or bullying situations and even sexual harassment. Well, Bianca, um, a friend of mine, I've worked with her for a few years. She actually contacted the union herself. Um, she contacted me because she knows that I'm really like a passionate person as well as her. It never gets old watching um, and helping workers uh, confront their boss and to take collective action that never gets old, it's inspiring. I wanted to know if everybody, if I had the support behind me. I think they were down. <laughs> like, they were down, <laughs> yeah. May 14th? It was May 14th. <laughs> Election day was the best day of my life. <laughs> Our management in my store acted a little crazy that day. They were doing like that last minute extra push to get us to say no. I mean, if you see someone fighting so hard against something you're doing, you know something is up. So it makes you want to fight even harder. I was at work and I was checking the text, checking the text. What was, what was the first thing you did when you heard the news? I, I cried. cried. I'm really proud to say that every single Verizon wireless store in Brooklyn is a union store. Correct, all of Brooklyn is unionized. And so we really do get the sense, right, that there's a movement starting among mostly young workers in Verizon Wireless. And Bianca and Tatiana started it. Two people, just two people started this movement. <laughs>